this is a video about one approach to making among the strongest possible pharmaceuticals, pharmaceuticals that are active at one part per quadrillion or one part per trillion. An approach are completely non-metabolizable molecules, perhaps similar to hopinoids or halogenated hopinoids, that surround themselves with hydration complexes, waters at uh, specific shapes, that are able to cause G-coupled protein receptors uh, to make an action. Now, when you think about it, with G-coupled protein receptors, uh, they have a similarity of um, protein structure, yet the most sensitive of them can actually respond to something with absolutely zero mass, photons. Thus, when you think about it, it might be possible to find G-coupled protein receptors that are able to respond to a change to the water molecules that surround them. I call those hydration complexes. I have read scientific literature that says that things like uh, DNA are actually uh, dependent on the hydration complexes that surround them to function normally. Thus, there is a published material that says the shape of hydration complexes surrounding molecules affects their function. When you're able to create a molecule that affects G-coupled protein receptors with only the hydration complexes that are near the G-coupled protein receptor, that creates a molecule that can be active physiologically over and over again because there's an absence of uh, hydrogen linkages, covalent linkages, ionic linkages, things like that. So the uh, molecule is able to uh, repeatedly activate a wide number or a large number of G-coupled protein receptors. Now, thinking of molecules that have the longest uh, physiological functionality, 